DDR, this is King Black. I wanted to comment on the Rick Ross and GD situation. Now that situation got blown out of proportion real quick. I don't understand what the GDs are all mad about Rick Ross using Larry Hoover's name in his track. It's not like he used it in a negative manner. And once again, it's just a song, it's just lyrics. You know, when they're going on video on World Star and YouTube talking about that they're going to threaten Rick Ross and that he better not come to North Carolina to do any shows and stuff like that. In retrospect, it's a stupid move on their part because, for one, Rick Ross didn't do anything negative using that name in his track. He wasn't dissing Larry Hoover, he wasn't dissing the GDs in any way. And then having the GDs threatening him on video is just a tool for law enforcement. Just think about it. If something happens at a Rick Ross concert, who's the first people they're going to look for? The GDs. And it might not just be any GDs. You want to look for the GDs specifically posting on World Star, YouTube, you know, talking and hollering, all this stuff. You know, you keep things behind closed doors. You don't talk about it on the internet flashing guns and stuff saying what you're going to do because if something does happen guess who the cops are going to go back to they want to look at that tape and every person that doesn't have their face covered is going to get rounded up you know I see so much energy being wasted on this situation when they should be more productive and actually be proud that you know Rick Ross used their founder's name in that song now I, I beef with GDs because they're folks you know, and I'm a Lion King. We are from the People Nation. We don't get along with GDs at all. Believe me, I don't like them at all. I don't like GDs. Fuck them. But I'm just trying to say, send a message to them. You know, think about it a little bit. Think clear with your head. You know what I'm saying? Step back from this situation. Take a deep breath and think about it. All those threats ain't worth it, man. I mean, the cops look at that. You know. And they already got you on their radar. So you just got to calm down, talk about it. It's not that serious.